going to share some cat photos with you, some of the cats we had when we were young. It's like one of the infamous cats was uh, Blackbeard. Uh, this was taken uh, on June 19th, 1970. His nickname was Blix. I used to call him Blix. I always had uh, nicknames for my, aunt, you know, my pets and stuff, but it's like Blackbeard was one, was a, um, you know, a, a important cat in my life. You know, it's like one of my favorites. It's like, so that's, that's Blackbeard. because he was a male calico because male calicos are very rare and uh, this was taken uh, looks like you know he looks like it says one and a half years old um, on the back of the photo can't quite tell it was taken uh, around August of 1969 and uh, one day unfortunately with Chico it's like one day he just disappeared one day we don't know what happened to him um, but uh, and then actually in this this photo it's like in this photo you can see that's one of the dining room chairs and we still have that dining room set we don't have the chairs in the house right now they're in the garage but the uh, we're using it as the kitchen table but it was in the, the dining room set was in the uh, dining room for like 100 years or so <laughs> I'm exaggerating um, then uh, let's see then this is um, this was taken the summer of 1971 and this is also a black beard and it looks like in we're, we're uh, believe it's one of our summer trips that we were going to take. I think this is one we were probably getting ready to go to um, Michigan because we took a trip to Michigan in 19, no, I'm sorry, 19, not 1971. We took it in 1970, so I'm not sure what trip we're going on, but he's uh, made himself comfortable in a, in a uh, suitcase. And then here's another picture of Blackbeard, um, one of my favorites. This is 1969. He's three and a half years old. And... Um, and he's hugging my shoe. I used to like boots a lot um, and wear boots a lot. Uh, I did until recently. I still like boots, but um, uh, he's uh, hugging my boot. I was like, probably not letting me take, get, put my shoes on. And then uh, this is also, I'm not sure. I think this is also Blackbeard. It's like I had two cats that look very similar. They're big black and white cats. The other, uh, the other one was uh, George. And uh, this is April 1971. It's, this must have been Blackbeard too. So, so, and I think I had George. Actually, I had George after I had Blackbeard. And that's me trying to do my homework with the cat. Then here's a couple. Oh, this is uh, interesting because this is taken in our backyard and what are kind of getting a sense of what the backyard and the garage and stuff look like. These are two unknown kittens. That's me and my sister. Um, I have the long, long blonde hair. Uh, anyway, it's like I don't know what, you know, it's like sometimes we would have kittens. Uh, we had a cat that had kittens and then we'd give the kittens away. So I'm not sure uh, the names of these kittens and stuff, but they were probably given away. And there's no date on it. That might be George, but I don't think it is. Um, and then here's like, this is another mystery. It's like a couple other cats. Um, and this, they were probably kittens that we probably gave away. Probably take, you know, this is probably take, picture taken around the same time. It's like, and that looks like our, old, our wood floors in our house. And then the same thing. Oh, this is half and half. That was his name. He was born April 18th, 1967. It's just a kitten, and we, we would have given We didn't keep him. We gave, must have given him away to somebody. And that's half and half. And then, uh, here's that other mystery picture of the two cats. We probably, kittens we gave away, probably must have given away. It's like, I don't, don't, they don't have names, but they were uh, given away. We probably initially gave them names, but uh, uh, they were given away to somebody. back to Blackbeard and so that's I just want to share some of the photos of some of my kitty cats and I know I've got pictures of George somewhere so when I find George I'll, I'll talk about him too and I, I you know it's like some of these cats I've pets I've had I've, I've set up uh, memorials for them and it's like I'm still in the process of doing that um, on findagrave.com so it's like you can always look up you know like some of the some of the names on here it's like they probably be in their last name of Costanza or Evans um, anyway that's
that's it. And I'll, uh, on to the next one. Yeah.